Oh, I love that one. Descarga.com or des, uh, jamsession.com in English. Descarga, discharge, is a jam session in Spanish. And uh, on that, we heard a bunch of fine San Diego musicians. Um, Jack Costanzo on Cong uh, congas. Uh, he's actually not San Diego, but uh, Mike Olguin on drums, timbales, and bell. Uh, Lynn Willard was the pianist, took a solo, Ignacio Arango on bass, Gilbert Castellanos and Bill Caballero on trumpet, Steve Feyerabend on tenor sax, Rob Campbell on berry sax, and Bob Johnston on trombone. That comes from an album called Back from Havana. And before that, it was Horace Silver and the Silver Brass Ensemble with the Hillbilly Bebopper, a tune that Silver wrote. Andy Bay was the vocalist, Red Holloway on alto sax, Branford Marsalis on tenor sax, Horace Silver, of course, at the piano, Carl Burnett on drums, and the album is titled It's Got to Be Funky, and that is one of my philosophies. <laughs> <laughs> I love funky jazz. Um, that's brilliant, Gary. What, what made you decide to play those tracks uh, particularly on this show? Well, uh, as I explained in the lead-up to the Hillbilly Bebopper, I think it, it sort of expresses the spirit of Yuma that, you know, they're, the people might look at it as, as kind of a bunch of hicks, but there's really a level of sophistication that you don't understand until you're a part of it. That's brilliant. That's great. And the other one, I just love Latin jazz, <laughs> and uh, I got to hear Caballero and... Uh, uh, Castellanos uh, in a trumpet duel in San Diego again at Dizzy's, wow. and uh, they, you know, they're just both amazing trumpet players, and um, it, it it featured a number of San Diego musicians who we draw on, of course, uh, because of their closeness for the Village Jazz Series. Yeah, and uh, just some great performances there here on uh, KAWC, and uh, I didn't even mention that we are KAWC Yuma and KWP Parker. We're also KOFA Yuma at 94.7 FM and 1320 AM. We're simulcasting this special 30th anniversary edition of Doc Jazz, um, all of our transmitters uh, this morning. And I want to, again, uh, just say thanks so much to Kerry for all of your uh, devotion to this uh, radio program and bringing it to us uh, Come rain or shine or pandemic or anything else, it's uh, still happening, and we're so grateful for you for doing it. And, of course, we should do a quick shout-out and a thank you to uh, Arizona Western College for making this radio station possible and uh, for having the foresight to take advantage of the opportunity to get that FM uh, transmitter back in 1992, uh, which uh, was kind of the inspiration for the creation of this program and the uh, the launch into jazz on board on a KAWC at that time, AM and FM. And uh, we're so glad you're still here. And I understand we have a thank you from someone at well, Arizona. We've, we've got a couple, couple greetings, yeah, since you were mentioning AWC. Uh, we've got a couple. You know, like some of these uh, are artists that come from farther away, but these are right here on campus. We've got a message from uh, the president of the college, Dr. Kaur, and also uh, from Ann Heather Welch, who is a uh, uh, border radio host. Yes, and we uh, this is live radio, and uh, we are going to hear the one from uh, Ann Heather Welch first, and uh, oh. because we still need to load up the one from Dr. <laughs> Kaur. Not, <laughs> you know, of course it would be that one, but um, the... Um, uh, well, like I say, it's live radio, and, and uh, there's a lot going on in the studio today. Uh, I have never worked so hard on a show <laughs> during the show as this one. Usually I just sit back.